And Joe Rogan's a big one, right? Joe Rogan is the biggest interview, I think, because not only are you going to have literally probably millions of people who watch that three-hour interview like only Joe Rogan can do and keep it interesting the entire time as a podcaster at The Daily Signal, I so respect Joe Rogan's ability to keep a, a long-form interview interesting, but you're going to have so many clips go viral from that interview, and that's going to be the most consumed content. So, I mean, if, if Trump does it, Harris has to do it. I don't think she has a choice. She has to do Rogan just because of that publicity. It's such a powerful opportunity. Well, I tweeted out to Joe Rogan, and I said that he should interview Matthew Foldy before even interviewing <laughs> Kamala it will Harris. Be, it will be my honor. I Mr. Did. Rogan, I, like, I accept Yo, the offer Rogan, you have given me. like, get him on. He's your biggest <laughs> fan. But look, I do think it would hurt Harris if she were to do the interview. If I'd be her campaign advisor, I'd advise her against it. Any of these long-form interviews, even these short-form interviews, they have not served. It's not been favorable towards Kamala. Kamala has messed up every single major interview, and I think that's been uh, very problematic for her. On the other hand, Donald Trump, he will appeal to that younger male voter, which I think are the ones like Foldy who just listen to Rogan. Honored to be time. younger. Would you oh. tell uh, <laughs> Kamala to do the interview with Rogan? Absolutely. I, and, I, and one of the things I'll say, you know, Donald Trump is not the same Donald Trump from nine years ago. Oh, the, boy. The, the, the are we going to go? Hold on, hold on, hold on. The, the repeating no, himself. Jason. I was good at sports. Come sports, on. you know, I, I really played sports. That I played mental sports. decline. Sports that's so what I think. But, but let me right. just finish what, I, what, what I was going to say. I think I'm one of the things this. he's, he's going to do, I, I didn't ask you to do it, but one of the things I will say is legalizing I didn't ask marijuana. You to ask me to do it. Uh, legalize marijuana. <laughs> Kamala, Harris, Kamala Harris, let me just Harris tell you, she put 1,900 people in jail That's a lie. For it's not. That's a lie. But Listen, they're all low. 47. Oh, I think the New York they're Post does lie. They should go oh. only on 40, the Joe like Rogan experience, the, yes. and they can We just talked out. about the media. We just talked about the I media I think he line. should host the next media. presidential debate. I think Joe Rogan needs to host a debate. So the New York Post isn't the media? Do you think they're lying? Do they lie about Hunter Biden's lifetime? The 1,900 number is convictions, not people who went to jail. Conviction. So that's a lie. Conviction. Oh, so tell me, Joe Rogan, come on this show. Yeah, Long story short, they should both uh, do Rogan. About, I think, 40 <laughs> went to jail. I think we've run out the clock here. But, you know. <laughs>